Hey guys, Mr. Movie, and today I'll be saying what I think Star the Star Wars trilogy would do after Episode 9 comes out in December. So, stuff I think they would do, I think they would uh, make more solo movies. I'm, I'm hoping directed by Ron Howard, but probably not, because Ron Howard's expensive. But, um, yeah, Darth Maul is in the last one. If you haven't seen that, we'll deal with it. And, um... Yeah, since Darth Maul was in the last one, at the end, and, uh, kind of left you hanging, like, in, uh, Force Awakens, kind of, when Kylo was, like, um, when Snoke was, like, bring Kylo to me, and you'll see me, and stuff, like that, so, yeah, that kind of left you hanging right there, and then, so I think they're gonna make a new one, maybe, it might, one of them will probably be, I'm, it would be cool if one was named Boba Fett. Or if just people that solo encounter that make movies about them and then solos end them and I'll be console will be in them and that's pretty cool. But the second thing they might do is uh, make a new trilogy of something. Maybe maybe like um a new Republic trilogy. Uh, that would be fine, you know. It's not like too fancy and stuff because yeah, like you don't really know what happened before the Republic. Yeah, that that would be pretty cool. I think maybe like a new Republic trilogy or. How the Republic is being... Oh, no, wait, no, they're gonna make a TV show about that. And, um... Yeah, they're making TV shows, which is actually pretty cool, and doing more Clone Wars stuff, because they make, keep making characters you can't explain. But, um... But, uh, like, the... There's the TV show, there's the other... There, like, there's the Mandalorian, which is pretty cool. It takes place after the Death Star, which I had my thoughts on that. You can check out that video. But then there's the other one that is kind of going to be like Agents of a Shield from Marvel. So, you know, it's not the exact same thing. And I'm hoping it's kind of like Rogue One where they show the more darker side. That's not everything's all sunshine lollipops with the um, uh, Rebels. I'm hoping it's not, yeah, like that. Like it wasn't kind of the original trilogy and how it is in like every single movie. Although it's, although that's kind of like the thing I liked about Gotham, the TV show. Because it was kind of like darker. Like, yo, you have to shoot him to win or but, yeah, I'm just hoping they take that approach on it instead of making it all nice and stuff, because that's not how it is. But, um, and the third one, I think, uh, more stories on people. There was the rumors of a Obi-Wan Kenobi movie after, after he gave the baby to, uh, L Lars's, um, after he gave Luke to the Lars, um, there was rumors of that with Ewan McGregor, which would be super cool, but, I don't know, I'd like to see maybe movies about, like, Bosk, Dengar, uh, Four L O M, all the bounty hunters. I G eight movie would actually be pretty cool. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. And um, yeah, that's that's really it, I guess. But um, yeah. So those are my thoughts. Uh, in the comments, say what you think Star Wars would do after Episode Nine. And um, yeah. See you next time, movie fans.